twenty bucks. Okay. So you paid uh, here. I paid five and five. We just spent seventy two bucks. We went to a uh, house sale. We know the people. Well, sort of. Well, I don't. They're I, locals. They're uh, locals, so I cross their kids, right. or they walk by me and my crossing. Okay. So um, who makes this? Uh, J Crew is the yellow. Oh, Joe Crew. It's nice. It's yellow. Marie figures at least twenty bucks. Five. It's fair. It'll cost. Five to ships, uh, not the huge, but well, four dollars maybe. Not huge profit, but it, maybe she'll get twenty-five. You never know. And what's yeah, this one? Like Are they both J Crew? That's Rachel something. Not for me, Robert there. something. I can't remember. Hold on. I'm trying to look at it. Uh... Here, give me. Just, just hold the tag so I can see it. I was like, I just wasn't my, I wasn't working my fingers right here. I'll show this. Again. Nice. Rachel. I keep thinking Matto. No. <laughs> that terrible Reinhardt. news person. Reinhardt. But these are turquoise and glass beads. You can feel the weight of it. It's are they actual turquoise or? I think so, yeah. Nice. This is a very beautiful piece. You don't know anything about that piece though, right? No, I have to look them up. All right, I'm going to put this with you. Um, I spent 62 on this stuff. The lady was priced at retail. Uh, I, I explained to her. Uh, and she said, eh, I know, I would just price it high, figuring I'd have to negotiate down. So she went to whatever the prices are on most of the stuff she went to have. Uh, here's a sword, a uh, um, Power Ranger sword. I don't know. I just paid 62 for everything. She had some Hot Wheels, but she was expensive for me because, you know, more than a quarter piece and they're, they're loose, well, I'm out. You know, you give them away, you know? I give a lot away and then I sell them for 50 cents if they sell. So it's like more than a quarter piece, I'm out. I don't know why they inked out this. They probably wrote their name on it, so nobody would steal it. But it doesn't matter. I could. I'll, I don't even know if I'm gonna try and clean that. It's just a big uh, dinosaur. This is just a fun plush. Let me see if it has any age. I'm sure it won't. Their kids aren't that young. I mean, old. They were less than. They were like ten or so. Let me see the date on this. Do, do, do. Oh, 2012. Okay. Not much age. It's probably good for a flea market or something for five bucks. These I can put in this store probably for 10 bucks each. 10 to 15. Probably 10 to 15. And they're just turtles. Micro mutants, turtles. Power Rangers like this, I can get maybe five in the store. I opened one of these, and one of the little dudes inside was headless. That's fine. I don't really care. You know, if I put these on eBay as a lot, they would sell. But, um, I mean, man. I'm just going to show these figures quick. They're no big deal. Here's the other Micro Mutant. So she wanted like 10 a piece, but they only sell. They start on eBay at like 12 bucks. Probably without some of the figures. Just fix the head. Okay. And here's another. I guess it's a Power Ranger. <laughs> this some of this is good for the store for sure. Here they have a DS Lite. They wanted 50 for it with five totally BS games. Not worth a penny. Uh, I don't, I'm not even going to show them to you because who cares? Look, Beyblade, SpongeBob, Jordan the Light. I can get 50 to 60 for this, so they that's what they, they went to half on, stuff like that. And they also went to half on, I guess. I'm surprised how not expensive these games are. Yeah, I'm at another sale. I'm going to get out of there in a second. Pokemon Tournament. This is like a $15, $12 game. This is like a $15 game. And you see, they priced it right exactly where it's supposed to be. Mario Kart 8 is like 15 to 20 Anyway, that's my first pickup. $72. No, I know. I'm going to I'm gonna move that onto my chair, and then I'll put it in the thing. Okay, I'm out of here. I'm going to the sale. Bye. Like so you found we're, we're reaching fourteen hundred dollars in sales. Nice, that's very good. All right, this is me complaining. Um, I went to a sale, and the lady had everything marked retail. I explained to her that I'm a shop, right? And uh, I said I could pay half of what you have because this is literally this is this is what we sell this for fifteen. Tell them who found the broken DS. Well, AJ loves to be Mr. Disappointing News. He's like, oh, look, too bad. Oh. So anyway, look, he's still laughing, bastard. So anyway, um, yeah, so everything's marked full price. So I say, hey, I'll buy all this stuff if you go half because I'm store. I just want to double my money. I'm not even trying to be greedy, right? And uh, it's, wait, let me see if it says on the paper. 
DS as is, and I already know it doesn't. So, full retail, but it's broken. But I'm not telling you that. This is why, I guess, kids, you have to look at everything. A uh, Nintendo Lite game console charger, $5 game, but no, nope, I don't see where it says hinge broken. So, anyway, I don't, that, what's the point of this video? That I need to check everything, and so do you, when you buy it, especially if they're asking full retail. Well, I, I mean, you know, if you have the gall to, to ask full retail for something... You know, you would think it would be in near perfect or, or in good condition, but whatever. Maybe I was just so excited to see gaming stuff that I was like, fuck it, I'll just buy it. All right, anyway, um, bye. Okay, um, second house, I bought some stuff at Marie's inside. She's buying jewelry. I actually bought this at the first house. That's just plugs. I'm actually going to take these to the store. These come in handy. There's a PSP-type charging plug. In there, and then there might be a uh, iPhone, and there might also be, I don't know, these were a buck a piece. I bought nine, and the milk crate for ten. That's eleven dollars, so. This is a big bottle of Taboo, a vintage one, made by Aunt Dana. This, I don't know who this is, Becoming oh, Avon, so that was probably a, a, a bad buy. This is good, this will pay for everything, plus uh, Jean Poteau, Jean Poteau, Paris. Uh, 30 million one ounce that ought to be worth 30 bucks and then i bought nine of these and depending on what they're worth i've, I've seen them as i've seen them low but then i saw somebody had it for 65 so what i'll probably do is probably do them in lots of two and it's snow lace paris i've never heard you know so uh, and i got this neat tray That'll be great for recycling. All right, I'm gonna lay everything down. So nothing falls down and breaks. Now I gotta go back and probably help Marie pay for some jewelry. Okay. Um, we spent eleven dollars. This is a. No, I see that. This is a really. Well, actually, it's not really long, is it? Oh, it's super long. Even with the bow? Yeah. Class? The bow is a class. Oh, wow. This is Gucci. No, Givenchy. Oh, Givenchy. Okay. Oh, there's the G. Okay. Let me focus that. It's kind of crappy, but I could get. You know, uh, you get more than twenty probably, but still very good. Very good. Now, actually, uh, they had a ton of jewelry. That's why I, 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 you were outside. I don't know what you were looking at, but I was like, Marie, jewelry. Come inside. Yeah. <laughs> well, I was looking at the sunglasses. Oh, oh, that's good. Okay. Um. Yeah, this is really long. This it's is super long. It's glass. Oh, that's nice. And it's it's got that oh, it's really signed pretty. or no? I don't think so. Son of a. But that's like opera length. No, no, it's super nice. But why can't it be signed? It's so annoying. Oh, this is like one of them Scottish that's pins. Scottish pin. It says mit mitzvah on the back. That sounds Jewish. It's uh, yeah. Back in the day, I used to think that too, but it's Scottish. Okay. Uh, oh, this is a pretty. It's a clamper. Continue one point one mile. Then turn right on the yeah. Oh, I, I don't think... Did I say you only paid $11? You paid a yeah. dollar a piece? This is sharp looking. That's nice. Very pretty piece. Yeah. Oh, you did buy some barrettes. How many did you buy? Just two. Uh, it, two rhinestones for yeah. like a lot? No, if they were marked France, I would have scooped them up. Sure. But they no, they look like they for, were from like the 90s and 80s. Yeah, and... 80s, 90s. But these two were rhinestone. Yeah, and the stones and, are set. Yeah. Oh, shoot. It's missing? missing a stone. Maybe it's in the bag. Damn it. If it's not in the bag, whatever. You can always... Oh, wow, it's the centerpiece. That's freaking annoying. Is yeah. that the one you... Oh, well. You know what? Those what, are sterling. Yeah, these are nice. Does anybody sterling or just sterling? I don't know. I just saw 95 and I put Good it enough. in my pile. I didn't, there's another nice... stamp there, but I don't know what it is. Okay, we'll figure it out later. Uh, this and is I cool. have to test it because the part that goes in the ear might be sterling, but the dangle might not be. Well, actually, so, the dangle looks like sterling, but is it yeah, not marked like sterling? The yeah, the back, the right? Backing yeah. Is, so I need to but in the front it. feels like it, you know? It has that kind of feeling. I don't know if you can describe we the way sterling feels. Wholesale in the city, they were doing that kind of scam. Yeah, I know. The part that went through your ear was marked 9 to 5, but the part that dangled from it Same was Same with gold. Not. They were like, they scrapped all their gold. So, I don't know who they, they said a, a jeweler. 
Is this one signed? No. No, but it looks like Czechoslovakian glass. Kind of. And it, it is set, so it's, it's pretty good. It's got the older clasp on it. Uh, and this is just another just rhinestone. Another rhinestone nice. Necklace. Like but, it. Well, this know, one's art. season is coming up. And it has an Art Deco look. You can say yeah, Art Deco on your photo. Yeah, season is coming up. I mean... Oh, and this is just a, a chain link kind of collar necklace. Yeah, that has a lobster claw clasp, so it's not that old, but yeah. I like the design of okay. it. Okay. It's That's sort of cool. like chain mail. Sure. As long as you can get like 20 bucks. Yeah. You know. All right, I'm going to put the jewelry away. Uh, that's Marie's Pickens. At least we're finding some stuff. Yeah. All right, let me turn this on. Just went to a yard sale. Nice lady. Um, but I checked there, yeah. prices on everything on eBay. Yeah, even she like. Does eBay. Yeah. Well, no, she does. She doesn't like eBay. She does Poshmark. But um, she used to do eBay. Yes, she so did. she knows about checking stuff. Which is fine. You know, it just means that if the price is too high, I don't buy. Ah. Yeah. I'm putting my seatbelt on for safety reasons. Well, because we're getting on the highway. Yeah, I'm not, I don't want to die. Horrible. If we get into a car accident, you're actually a pretty good driver. How many times have you gotten in a car don't accident? Don't jinx me. Shut up. I was I was actually going to joke. You've only been in what, like 10, Stop. 20 car accidents? No, no, no. <laughs> like about 30, 40. So anyway, here. Uh, this is the only thing you bought was a fur clip. I had saw some other stuff that I thought Emery might like, but you know, I don't really look hard at, at jewelry. I let her do it because she's the deciderer on that stuff. And uh, I, because I really thought you would like that that necklace with the faux pearls and the tiki kind of figure, but um, you said it had damage. So anyway, um, two dollars. But it's also bone. I can't put that on eBay. No bone, you can. And either way, no. it's cool. No, I had a necklace that only it was made out of bone, not ivory. You don't even just have to bone. say bone. You you don't even say bone. Well, I know that now. Yeah, but you wouldn't even say but it. Because it, it was, oh what do they call God, those just pearls? Stop arguing with me. I'm not it was arguing. An ugly necklace. No, no, what and... were the pearls? I, I'm trying to remember the name of the pearls. The long the pearls. pearls. Yeah, the, or was it shell? What are you talking about? It had, the necklace part of it had either shell or pearl. What were they? The long ones. They're shaped like kind of like a tube. Okay. I don't know what you're talking about. Uh, well, I'm, I mean, it, it, that's what it had. It had beads, right? You looked at the beads in the necklace, right? Yeah. So what kind of beads did it have? Oh, I don't remember. Okay, well, it had long, like, pearl or okay. shell beads. Take yeah, what's that? that? Okay, but that's not even the point. What's the name of the long pearl that's beads? I forget the name of those. If they're pearl beads, they're pearls. The, I don't understand your question. The name of the shape of a long pearl bead. The ones that are shaped, like, tubular and long. I'm going to have to look it up. Could be baroque. That's it, baroque. Thank you. All right, anyway. Still got a bunch of sales to go to. Going to the next one. In case anybody's curious, the name of long pearl I, beads. I don't, know, I don't know what you're talking about. I, they're talking about long pearl beads. The ones that are like tubes, like tubulars, like long. You know, stick shape. All right, baroque. Anyway, on to the next one. Okay, um, we spent $22. And I had to be, apparently I have to be careful with some fish or some delicate fish in there. Um, first thing I'm showing is a Brighton box. I'm going to have to switch the battery in this phone. I'm killing it. Uh, I'm at 15% battery. A uh, Brighton box ought to be worth 20 bucks Or more. I don't really know. This is a... Uh, I tried to read it before. I had to redo the video because whatever. It says Calandrio Azteca. Calendar. It's an Aztec calendar. No, but it's in Spanish. Yeah. It means Aztec calendar. Yeah, I was going to get to that. You ruined it. Piedra del Sol. Uh, del Sol. Now, that's a lot of words just to say Aztec calendar. What's this? Gold. Oh, okay. Uh, this is the major finding. Well, Go ahead. one thing is gold, but the other thing is silver. Oh, but it's got, good. like, rubies in it. I really like this enamel pin. It's nice. This cross and the chain is gold. Nice. But this is um, silver. and But those are, like, probably, like, old rubies, rubies but not, like, good quality good ones. Yeah. But it's nice. These are cool. I'm sure you didn't get a chance to check the prices on these, but it's it's Miller. Well, her name is on the cards. Oh, okay, good. I didn't see the cards yet. Um, I thought they you were got a few fun. Though. This is cool. This is a, a big like a, pendant necklace. It's a freaking piranha. No, it's totally cool. I got to show the other two. I just I was I didn't read the name. Oh, it's Joan Miller. There it is. Um, this I'll get to them. Made in India, and it says oh, it's from 1971. Date on it? I think so. It says 71, unless it's a design number. Joan Miller, Inc. Okay. 
And they're just, it's cool because they're all kinds of, that's an eel, and I guess this is just Oh, like I didn't a, see that the enamel was messed up. Oh, whatever. So, you did good because you bought gold, so, who cares? Oh, and you got a little baby Joan Miller uh, one. Yeah. Mm, nice. You bought four of them. Oh, oh, and these earrings are cool. They go with that necklace. Because they go with this necklace. Okay, that's it, 22 bucks, and we got some gold. Nice. There you go, I'm trying to All right, uh, I went to two sales, and I spent two for this dragon, and I think it's cool. It's it's only worth like maybe ten to twelve dollars, but I like it. I think somebody give me five to ten for it. And I found this Murano vase. It's not a a, a bottle. It doesn't need a stopper because you don't feel anything in it. No, and it, it's it's got that. What we what you call it? Silver fleck. Yeah, I guess it has a venturine in it, and it does have a pontal bottom, so it's a decent little old one. It was only five bucks, so um, that's it. Two, two, two sales. So I have a bunch to go to. There's a few on there we're not going to. Okay. All right. Well, we're probably only going to go to about three, right? Yeah. yeah. We should go to three. All right. On to the next one. Last, I finished. That's the last sale. I bought this. Um, three dollars. Uh, how do you feel? How do you think we did today? I mean, you did get a lot of jewelry, and if you translate each piece of jewelry, like, say, $10 profit after whatever, at the very least, um, you probably did all right. Let's see how it's... Yeah, kind of seven plus two. Yeah. You didn't really spend that much today. It was like... Uh, 72, 94, 97, 98, 18... 125 plus 3, like 128. Uh, yeah, I I bought some stuff. I mean, it's okay. I think probably all, all the money I'm going to make is on the perfumes that I bought. And then we bought a bunch of jewelry and should do well with that. Anyway, that's it. Uh, I'm heading to the store now. I'll see if anything interesting happens there, if there's anything good that we get, hopefully today. All right, I'm out of here. Thanks for watching. Bye.